Warning, all of our videos are made only for educational purposes and to demonstrate scientific laws that we verify. These experiments must be supervised and we are not responsible for an incorrect execution of an experiment done by others. We do not encourage in any way that you misuse our experiments to do violent things and harm others. Hello everyone, welcome back to Chemistry by Destiny. Today we see a video in which we will synthesize calcium hydroxide. So, uh, to do this experiment, uh, we're just going uh, to need uh, some uh, calcium chloride or calcium carbonate and then some hydrochloric acid and uh, sodium hydroxide. So, let's see this experiment. The procedure uh, for this experiment is firstly to prepare a solution of hydrochloric acid uh, by mixing 18, uh, 18 milliliters of hydrochloric acid with 25 milliliters of water. Then we add to this solution uh, 10 grams of uh, calcium carbonate and finally we uh, prepare another solution in which, in which we will put 9 grams of uh, sodium hydroxide with 15 milliliters of water. Uh, when we prepare this solution we just have to add uh, this second solution to the first one and we will see the precipitate forming. So another uh, thing that we can do for this experiment is to start from uh, calcium chloride. In fact, uh, with this method we will get a better yield. And uh, in fact, what we uh, just have to do uh, is to uh, prepare a solution of uh, sodium hydroxide, in particular uh, um, using uh, 15, gram 15 grams of sodium hydroxide. And uh, after we just have to um, put uh, uh, 11 grams of uh, calcium chloride into this solution and we see the precipitate again for you. So, uh, the reactions in this experiment that occur are firstly between uh, calcium carbonate uh, and uh, uh, we have uh, hydrochloric acid. Uh, according to the current reaction, uh, we see that some calcium chloride is formed uh, and this is what we actually need in order to produce uh, our calcium hydroxide. Uh, then uh, we make uh, this uh, calcium, react, uh, calcium chloride react uh, with a solution of sodium uh, hydroxide uh, which uh, is able uh, to uh, produce uh, our uh, um, uh, calcium hydroxide. Uh, what is left uh, is to dry our, uh, our uh, salt uh, which is uh, insoluble in water uh, and uh, through a filtration method which can be gravity filtration uh, we are going uh, to dry it up uh, and uh, store it.
So I'm Andy Super and we want to tell you something about the precaution for this experiment. In particular, you have to be uh, really careful when uh, you use uh, hydrochloric acid and uh, sodium hydroxide solutions because they are really corrosive. So everyone, if you like this experiment, leave them on the comments. Uh, and if you want to see more amazing experiments like this, uh, go visit the page and subscribe to it. Uh, so for today is all. Thanks for watching. <laughs>